This is Mr. Hino. It's another lesson uh, for math. And today's lesson is going to be on adding integers. Adding an integer like you see here where you have a negative 5 plus a positive 3. And there's many different ways to solve this. But today's video is going to show how to add these integers using a t-chart. So here we go. We have a negative 5 plus a positive 3. Let me kind of push this up here. So what I ask my students to do is, if they're having a hard time, uh, an easy way to do this is just to make a t-chart and have a positive side and a negative side. So what I ask them to do is basically to look at it as you know, a football team, a baseball team, where one team is one side and the other team's on the other side. Basically, in this case here, a positive side and a negative side. So what we want to do is, because the negative 5, uh, the 5 is negative, we're going to put that over here. And because the 3 is positive, we're going to put that on here, this side. So what I tell them to do is, is one of the rules is if they are on different teams to subtract. Okay, different teams subtract. So in this case here, they would go 5 minus 3 is 2. And then I tell them another, the last rule is whoever has the most points wins the game. So 5 beats 3, and it's a negative, so the answer would be a negative 2. So that's just an easy way to add integers and to... Um, use a t-chart to get the answer relatively easy. Okay, so now let's look at what would you do if you were adding two negative integers. So if we have a negative 7 plus a negative 5, we can still use the t-chart to figure out the answer. So let's push this up here. So we got our same t-chart, positive side, negative side. So before, we knew that if they were different signs, we'd put them on different teams, and we'll, we would subtract. So let me bring that paper back here. So again, different teams, we would subtract. But in this case here, they're both on the same team. The negative 7's on the same team as the negative 5. So what I'd end up doing is just putting them on the same team. So the 7's negative, he goes here, and the 5 is negative. So we would put that here. And so the rule for that now is if they're on the same team, we would add. So 7 plus 5 is 12. And again, the rule is the team with the most points wins. And since the negative team has all the points and positive has nothing, it would keep the sign of the winning team. So the answer to negative 7 plus a negative 5 would be a negative 12. So I hope this helps. It's um, just an easy way to add integers. Hopefully you can get to the point where you don't need this t-chart. But if you're having troubles or just starting off, this is a good way to learn them. And thanks for watching. And this is Mr. Hino.